good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and of course, big racing fans, welcome to the great Anderson County Fair 2014. I'm your swine master, Wayne Rosaire, and you're at Pork Shop Downs. We have a super show lined up for you, a total of 14 pigs will be racing around this 190 foot track. We've got 14 pigs racing in three different heats with three different breeds. The first heat consists of five of the USA Swine Speedsters. The second race, we've got five Hall and Hybrid Racers, and the third race, something truly unique to big racing, the Asian Pot Bellet Racing Pig, the Orient Express. And right now, without any further ado, as our first five athletes come racing out of the trailer and into the paddock, how about I make South Carolina welcome? Make some noise, let's hear it from everybody! Thank you, and there they are. These pigs right here, 100% domesticated pig. That means they're the kind of pig that you see every day down the farm. They are a Yorkshire. Now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls in the audience, I will be picking out five cheerleaders, or if you will, five pig rooters. That's right, pig rooters. Now, if one of you lucky pig rooters root your pig from the starting gate all the way around the track, the first pig to cross the finish line will be the winner. Then that winning pig rooter will then step right up here by me and receive some prizes that I have for them. For those of you that got here early and you went down to our concession stand and you are planning on game pig a pig, if you guys want any time during the show, you'll have to wait to get your prizes until the show is over. We run all three heats. If you have a ticket from pig a pig, then you'll take it back to our concession stand to get your piggy prizes. Once again, good luck with pig a pig. Now, in order for me to pick out cheerleaders or pig rooters here today, I want a little audience participation, such as raising your hands in the air, jumping up and down, yelling, shouting, screaming, anything out of the norm to catch my attention. And I will pick you to be a pig rooter. Now remember, there are 14 different pigs racing here today, so 14 different pig rooters will be picked out of this audience. But right now we just have five pigs in the first race, so obviously I need five pig rooters! One of you will be like the winner. That's right, jumping, yelling, shouting, and screaming. You're going to go hog wild to be a pig rooter. I'm looking for number one right over there. And really going, going hog wild in the white shirt and the checkered shorts right there. You're a number one pig rooter. You just stay right there. Root that number one pig around the track. Get your friends and family to help you. If your pig wins, then you come up here by me to get your prize. Remember numbers that easy. Number number two right now. And they're going hog wild. They're going hog wild to be a pig rooter. Going hog wild right there in the orange shirt. Got a bright orange shirt on. You're a number two pig rooter. Don't go away, number two. We haven't run the race yet. You just stay right there. Ruth, the number two pig around the track. Look at number three now. We're going hog wild. Going hog wild. Way up high. Back on the bridge. Got the black shirt. The racing sheet there. Got the white hat on. You're a number three pig rooter. Look at number four. Number three going hog wild. Hog wild right there. The yellow and white stripe. Sure, you're number four pig rooter. And number five, we need one more. We need one more pig rooter. we go hog wild. We got a squealer. The young lady's squealing right here in the white top. You're our number five pig rooter. And don't we now have our five pig rooters here for our first pig race? And for those of you who did not get picked out this time around, remember there are 14 different pigs racing here, so nine more different pig rooters will be needed during the show. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, my assistant, Mr. Evan Bacon, has placed the pigs into the starting game. What we will be doing next is placing onto the pigs backs are silks. They're numbered one through five, so you guys can identify them as they race around the track. As Evan does this, I will give you the pigs names. Starting from the inside, wearing that yellow silk, is number one, Shaking Bacon. Right there, Shaking Bacon. Uh, you guys can do better than that. Make some noise. That's here for Shaking Bacon. That's the way to do These pigs can hear you. Right next to one, a turquoise silk, number two, Pork Chop Ham. Raise that boy, Pork Chop Ham. There you go. I named that pig after my older daughter. It's a very aggressive pig. Uh, down the middle, and the orange silk is number three, Harry Hambone. Oh, yeah, he's bad to the bone, Harry Hambone. Next to Harry wearing a purple silk is number four, Sizzle and Sausage. Sizzle and Sausage. He is a newcomer to the track. And on the outside rail, wearing a red silk is number five, Oscar Meyer. Oscar Meyer. That's right, everybody always loves Oscar Meyer. Okay, the pigs are in the starting gate, the silks on the back, so we're ready to go racing. Now, all you pigmenters out here, not just the ones I picked out, but everybody, the louder you yell, shout, and scream for these pigs, the faster they will go. You know what? We better practice that one time. Everybody, let them hear you make some noise! There you go, Anderson County, loud and proud. You guys keep that up, and the pigs are going to fly. At the sound of the bugle, they will be up. Number one, shaking bacon. Number one, pig rooter. 
around the track. I need to come around the track, right over here by me to receive your prizes. We didn't start out that slower set of picks. As each heat goes on, they're going to get faster and faster. Naturally, the third heat will be the fastest. That was a very close race right there. Harry Hamburg took over coming out of turn three into turn four. Out of turn four, down the home stretch, Harry did have the lead. But they finally got halfway down the home stretch, down to the finish line. They were neck and neck. I'm right over the line. Number one won it about a, by a quarter of a pick snout. This is the lucky first winner. Let's make some noise for this young lady. She's the one with number one, Shake and Baker. Excellent job going hog wild over there. Shake and Baker, bringing home the bacon for you here today. And what's your name? Olivia. Olivia, have you ever seen a pig race before? First time the track, and you're a lucky winner. Olivia, I have a lot of prizes here for you. But first of all, I need to see the back of your hand. I'm going to give you a first place stamp right here. It's a very cool looking pig. We'll put it right there on the back of your hand so we know that you wanted the pig races. You can scrub and scrub with that thing. You won't come off for a week. Ladies and gentlemen, we award Olivia with our very own first place gold medal. That's right, Olivia. You are a gold medal winner out here today. After all that hard picketing, a gold medal is certainly well deserved. I'd like to give you one of our bumper stickers, too. Our bumper sticker says, promote pork, run over a chicken today. That's the other white people that are chicken love it there. They're trying to help the pork out. Uh, we're going to give you an extra credit prize. And this one comes from the Adorafon's Petting Zoo. The Adorafon's Petting Zoo is just off the hill down over there. That's an exotic petting zoo. It's not a regular petting zoo. It's an exotic petting zoo. they got a real-life giraffe over there by the name of Melman. Uh, the black and white animal down there between the baby camel and the Watusi. That's a yak. And you don't see many of those around at all. So make sure you guys check out the petting zoo. And they also brought the pony rides here with them this year. And you're going to get one free pony ride. You're going to be right behind the set of real life pony brought to you by the Adore Farm Penny Zoo. That's your ticket to ride the ponies completely free. We're also going to give you a pick at a game pick a pig. Before the show started, I invite people to come down to play a game pick a pig for piggy prizes. And no pair of you should betting here the big racing check. We do play a game pick a pig for piggy prizes. But they can only play before the show starts, except for you. We're going to let you play right now. When you leave me, you're going to go there and see Chris. He'll give you a free pick on the next race coming up. And if you pick out a winner, you're going to go home with more piggy prizes, okay, so pick out a good one. And let's now begin to give you a full living color portrait of Tyrone the Terrible. Ooh, everybody go, ooh, ooh. Yeah, we do that because Tyrone's one bad dude. And we'll see Tyrone race the boat later on the show. Congratulations, sweetheart. You're a gold medal winner. You go over there right now and get a free pick from Chris, okay? You did a fantastic job. Ladies and gentlemen, a nice round of applause for a lucky first winner. Ladies and gentlemen, Roseanne's Royal Racers are a free show for everybody. Brought to you by our sponsors. Our sponsors are the great Anderson Fair Board Committee themselves. Along with Oler Productions. They bring us out to all these great functions. And Anderson uh, Ford and Mazda dealer. Anderson Ford and Mazda, our fine sponsor, Roseanne's Royal Racers. Now, did everybody enjoy that first pig race? Yeah. All right, excellent. Would you like to see some more? Okay, then you're going to get more. As you did see, the USA Swine Speedsters, well, they work quite fast. But the ones you're about to see right now, these hauling hybrid racers are a whole lot faster. These guys right here, true hybrid, a combination of two different breeds of pigs, Hampshire and Duroc. A uh, Hampshire is a black pig with a white band around his shoulder, and a Duroc is an all-red pig. They are a combination. That makes them a hybrid. We've got five more pigs. That means I need five more pig rooters. Whatever you will be a lucky winner. Jumping, yelling, shouting, and screaming. I can't hear you. Checkered shorts on, little dude, you got the biggest mouth on the big racing track. You're on number five pig rooter. Mom already knew that, huh, Mom? We're going to have five pig rooters. Uh, Evan Baker's got the pigs in the starting gate. He'll get the silks on the backs, and I'll give you the names. Yes. Now, kids, you might recognize some of these pigs as being famous. We're going to go from the outside in this time. On the outside, number one, Lady Haga. Lady Haga, and the crowd goes wild. If you didn't, I understand. Right next to her, number two, Boston Bacon Beaver. And yeah, we picked him up out of Miami about a month ago. Uh, down in the middle, number three, Katie Piggy Perry. Yeah, that's Evan's personal favorite. Next to Katie Piggy, number four, Miley Swinus. Yeah, you guys all know 
why they call us swiners. And on the inside rail, number five, Britney Spare Ribs. Oh, don't you worry. Britney's racing a lot better after therapy. Okay, the pigs on the side gate, the sun's on the back, ready to race. Well, you guys, you'll shout and scream the faster they do go. At the sound of the bugle, they will be off. receive your prizes. We are now going to clear the track for the main event coming up next. We saved the biggest, the best, of course, the absolute fastest to the last. As the old adage goes, you haven't seen anything yet. You haven't seen a set, a couple of sets of domesticated pigs race here. The Orient Express is not to miss out today, featuring Tyrone the Terrible. A lucky second winner is making their way through the crowd right there. Keep on going, sweetheart. There you go. You can duck underneath the rope if you like. There she goes. She's making her way around there right now. She went hog wild out there. Bring that number three pig all the way down to the finish line. Katie Piggy Perry. And here she comes right now, right over here, sweetie. Let's make some noise for this young lady. She's the woman number three, Katie Piggy Perry. How you doing? Congratulations on a fine big win. You did an excellent job out there. You went hog wild. You got my attention. And what's your name? Kara. Kara, that's a very pretty name, Kara. Have you ever seen a pig race before? No. No, you haven't. Okay, very good, very good. Right, well, let me ask you this. Did you like those pigs? Did you like them? Yes. Yes, she did. Awesome, awesome. And are you out here with Dad today? Yes. Fantastic. Do you like Dad? Yeah. Of course you do, Kara. Now, you told me you like the pigs, and you like Dad, but who do you like better, the pigs or Dad? Dad. Oh, true good of Dad out here today. Dad, you must be a winner. You want to go racing? We're going to start racing Dad's next. I'll be right in there with you. Yeah, we'll put a silk on. We're, no, we're not really going to do that. We're going to give you a daughter prizes, though. Uh, Kara, let me see the back of your hand, honey. This is your first place stamp. Hold your hand up just like that. Very cool. It's a very cool looking pig, and we put it right there for you. Ladies and gentlemen, we have one Kara Wood, our very own first place gold medal! That's right, Kira. You are a gold medal winner out here today. After all that hard picking and hanging out with Dad all day and all night, honey, you definitely deserve a gold medal, right? We're going to give you a promote for bumper sticker. You just stick this thing on the back of your neighbor's car. Extra free enterprise this time around. Coming from the Adorf on Penzi once again. They have one of the only two traveling aviaries in the country, okay? One of them right here in Anderson this year. And full of over 200 parakeets inside the aviary. Aviary is that place where birds hang out, if you didn't know that. And they got over 200 birds inside the aviary. It usually costs a few dollars to go in there and hang out with them. And you can feed them, too. Do you like birds? You do? Awesome, Kara. You're going to have another great one. This is a free pass to go inside the parakeet aviary out here today. That's the parakeet adventure. You're going to have a lot of fun with that. After you leave me, you're going to go over there and see Chris. He's going to give you a free pick on the last race coming up at a game pick a pig. You pick out a winner, and you'll go home with more piggy prizes. And let's not forget to win this lovely lady with a full of color portrait of Tyrone the Tyrone. Terrible! The famous racing poppily pig. We're going to see Tyrone put it up next. Congratulations, on Kerry. You did a fantastic job. You're a gold medal winner. Go over there and see Chris right now. Ladies and gentlemen, a nice round of applause for a lucky second winner, Kira! We are Rosario's Royal Racers, and we come from Sarasota, Florida. We travel extensively around the street nation of our playing county fairs, state fairs, and private parties. We're very proud to be part of the great Anderson County Fair. Ladies and gentlemen, for those who did play our game, Pig a Pig, and you've already won a couple races, congratulations. I hope you win the third race coming up. It gives you all three races, and you'll get $18 worth of piggy prizes, including that flying pig hat. What you don't know is if you play Pig a Pig is that everybody gets a prize when they play. So after the show is over, one more heat to go. After the show is over, if you have a paid for a racing sheet from Pig a Pig. Take it back to the session stand, whether it be a winner or a non-winner. The winners will be at the Piggy Prizes, and the non-winner is going to have a promote port bumper sticker just for playing Pig a Pig out here today. Once again, thank you guys for playing Pig a Pig, and good luck coming up here in our last race. All right, don't make ready to go race at the end. Epa Baker's ready. Are you guys ready? I knew you would be. This is the race you've all been waiting for. What you are about to see right now is something truly unique to pig racing. We've stopped at nothing to bring you fine pig racing entertainment. In fact, we went deep down the tropical rainforest of Asia to bring these next athletes to you. And here they come, the Asian pod-bellied racing pigs, the Orient Express.
from your eyes as they flash around the track at breakneck speed. If you blink, you'll be missing all of the action. They are true speedsters in every sense of the word. Do not be fooled by their size or demeanor. They are totally agile and can be very aggressive. Now, because we do have such a very special kind of pig, it's only appropriate that I do pick out some very special kinds of pig rooters. Stop the show. I forgot. Here in the last race, we always like to announce for the extra free added prizes right up in front here. Once again, it comes to the door front penning zoo. This time around from the penning zoo, you're not going to get a free pony ride or a free trip to the parakeet adventure. Instead, we got you one free camel ride. You're going to be riding high to sell a real life dromedary camel by the name of Bubba. It's an awesome ride and a free one for you when you win. On behalf of the door front penning zoo, we've got prizes galore, and I'm looking for four Bobby Ted You have got what it takes. You are number two, probably Pen Rooter. They have all hang out number two. Look at my number three now going down the other further. And if you're out there, you're going to pop it out. You're going to probably be a probably Pen Rooter. The young lady will have the pink blouse and pink hat and the white socks on. You are number three, probably Pen Rooter. They all hang out number three. And number four, I need one more. I need one more, probably Pen Rooter. Now you're gonna get arrested. We've got our four pigs, and unfortunately, number five is out today with a bull hamstring. All right, never mind. Let's get out the starting gate. He put me up to that one. We only have four pigs. All right, good luck to everybody here today. Starting on the inside, number one, Rolling Thunder. Rolling Thunder. Oh, come on, Anderson, Rolling Thunder. That's the way you do it. Right next to him, number two, Tyrone the Terrible. Down in the middle, the overweight runner himself, number three, Heavy P. Yes, right there for you. Heavy P, uh, overweight runner. And on the outside rail, direct from the rehab center, number four, Lindsay Loham. <laughs> Lindsay Loham, yeah, that's dad's favorite. Okay, the pigs are starting in the social club back to the racing. Louder, you guys yell, shout, scream, the faster they do go. At the sound of the bugle, they will be up.
there. Rolling Thunder knew he had it. He didn't swing across the line until he saw those guys come out of turn four. And you know what? I know we got you on this one. We said they were going to run real fast and all. Obviously, they didn't. We trained them to run slow. If you get them out of the track, they're good for about 200 yards. You really can't catch them. They're just well trained. They are the adults of our troop. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of all our sponsors, I'm Wayne Rosaire, and I hope you've enjoyed our show. Thank you guys for coming out playing with us. I need my last winner to come down here and get your prizes. There he is right here. Winner with Rolling Thunder, my little pop belly pig winner. If you did play a game, pick a pig. Take your tickets back to our concession stand and to redeem your prizes. The winners will be getting the piggy prize and the no money to get out from Oprah Bubba Sticker. You guys are rocking crowd. God bless you. Have fun the rest of the day here at the Great Anderson County Fair 2014. I've got some more prizes to give away. I told you, pig roll.